Oh man. <laughs> you know, my therapist is training me to think of other people's needs before, before, uh, you know, ahead of my own. And so that's what I was doing this morning. And, and I was like thinking, okay, my dad doesn't like to drive me around too much and waste gas. And I'm like thinking that lady, the, um, that is in charge of how much I spend, how much I make, excuse me, at a job and stuff. The land, a uh, land list lady. God, I can't talk. <laughs> um, she will be calling me probably next coming week before my dad leaves on a fishing trip. And I was like thinking, well, they're downtown and the food pantry is downtown too. So whenever I get done with meeting with them, we can swing by the food pantry. And so that's what I was like telling dad. Um, and so today we can go whenever that lady calls and whenever she plans with us to go to meet with her and my job counselor. And so he got mad that I was thinking ahead, be ahead, like, you know, like, like, trying to, you know, be compassionate of his feelings, you know? And, God, it's like, oh, I, sp I spend all morning waiting for you to call. I was going to do biking, go to Fleet Farm, do this, do that, and you have to cancel. And I'm like, Dad, I was, like, trying to be compassionate of your feelings here, <laughs> you know? Lordy, lordy, lordy. You know, and compromise, yeah. I just woke up, sorry, I can't find the right words. <sighs> boy, oh boy, oh boy. <laughs> So he's agreeing with that. So no, no food pantry today, but whenever that lady calls and schedules. And Shaley will be over around like one o'clock or something. She couldn't come over yesterday because she was busy. If you didn't have a pilot light, the gas overtakes the oxygen and now you're breathing straight gas. We used to shut his door. For some reason, we didn't shut his door that night. And they usually don't fly at night. I could hear Elliot screaming and flashing and just flying all around us. I could smell the gas, but I was incorporating it all into my dream. Around 3 a.m., officials began evacuating the homes in the neighborhood. Evacuate your house. There's a gas fight.
present West Virginia. These crumbling buildings are home to the terrifying creatures ever to walk the earth. Or at least, that's what some of them believe. And I was thinking too about a job on how um, it's summer now, I could probably work three days a week, like Monday, Wednesdays, and Fridays for the summer. You know, for four hours around there. And when the fall hits for school, I can only work Monday and Friday. I was thinking that, but it all depends on what the lady says about my money and everything. Maybe I'll be happy with two days a week. I'll probably think of it that way first, so. I'm waiting for my food now. I just ordered. So. Alrighty. Mm -hmm. job for four hours each day because I don't want my dad to pay extra rent every time um, fall is here and everything for school so I'll just stick with two days a week until I graduate and I'm home now so yeah oh it's warm out there guys we be taking a shower later in the night too Oh. 
I'll leave at 2.30 for my appointment. Ow. Oops. You need your key, Nora. Silly goo. Bishop is six feet one inches tall with brown hair, brown eyes, and a medium build. He is fluent in French, Italian, and Serbo-Croatian, and holds a diplomatic passport. The FBI created this computer-aged photograph to reflect how Bishop might look today. If you have any information about this case, please contact us at unsolved.com. Yeah, you guys, I'll only finish off the fries and keep the fish for later. I don't want to overstuff my stuff to where I throw and feel like I'm going to throw up at the doctor's office when she pushes down on my back, pushes down near my stomach, so. I just don't want to, you know. I just don't think I have the time because if it's packed in there, it looks like it is. I'm reviewing one of my I videos right now. So I need to call that to tell him I'm okay. So this is why I stopped the hyperlapse. So, ooh, just lightning. All right. I'll be taking my pills too. Yeah. You can barely see out there with the screen. Ooh. Thunder and lightning, very, very frightening me. <laughs> um, but yeah. So I'm gonna take my medication and go to bed now. Dad is safe. And I called him thinking, oh, you must be wondering where I am, and da 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 da. I left my phone. Then it all made sense. The tar on her face, the leaves in her hair. You've been roughing it? Amy had been living on my rooftop for over a month so she could watch me come and go. Hello, Oliver. Oh, God. Hey, Amy. And that was the first time I saw the truth. Amy was bad crazy. You need to pack up your little camp right now, go home, and leave my brother the hell alone. Oliver and I are meant to be together. I broke up with you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So myself going out all the time so I can remember I can... Yeah. Um, that looks closed. It's closed all the way though. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Okay. Ah, I thought... These other things. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Right in here. Just putting this money away here. Alrighty. Alright. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Alright, now I'm ready to go. Mm -hmm. I know a shortcut. Okay. Dishes are washing in the dishwasher. And maybe later, later we can say hi to um, Tilly. Okay. If she's home. <laughs> Debbie's home, yeah. Oh, she said she's going to Appleton for an appointment. I don't know if she'll be home by then. Mm -hmm. I saw her earlier outside. Hi. Hi.
Yeah, you can come in the room and see what it's like mm -hmm. to prepare yourself for your back cracking. Oh, I can, I can go in with you? Yeah. Oh, I didn't know that. Please, he like failed his driving test over 3,000 times. <laughs> And that was funny too, where Patrick had a headphone set put on him. Oh yeah, and he was and trying he to cheated, help him yeah. pass his test, but I was cheating, yeah. My baby girl was a sweetheart. For being a dumb, dumb person, Patrick sure knew a lot about driving. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe he was reading person. out of the book, I think. Oh yeah. <clears throat> Yeah, Patty was a sweet kitty. Yeah. I hope she made tons of friends up in heaven. I'm sure she did. Especially, maybe she made up with my cat, Baby. Yeah. <laughs> For that time when they got in the cat fight. <laughs> yeah, I am tired. Like, I could go to sleep for a while. <laughs> yeah. Probably start going to bed at seven. <laughs> That's how tired I feel. Yeah. I want to finish watching that crazy ex story and then we'll put that in the on. Yeah. <clears throat> if I was that girl, I kicked that boyfriend out of the house. He's a jerk and he's just using her. And Monday around what time? Um, like an afternoon. Maybe have a nap. Old fifty. Catch you guys later. Yeah. Oh, 35. Yeah. So I have to put lotion on there. <coughs> it still felt wrong. Robin was freaking out, but she wasn't doing anything about it. Oh, this place is nice. I'm gonna get my oh, clothes so nice. Thank you. I'll tell you, it's not just So I convinced her that we should follow him home. <laughs> I'm tired right now. I could feel like I could go to sleep. <laughs> it's not a joke. <laughs> he was unloading a bunch of stuff in his car. Oh, yeah. It's over. I'm gonna go to bed early tonight. <laughs> I'm almost tempted to get washed up. And just go to bed. <laughs> yeah. Not a joke. Yeah. Oh. Like there's something in this eye now. Sam Hack. Come on. <sighs> okay. Probably. Uh, Beep, bop, beep, ba, da, boop.
He's a cat man. <laughs> I'm goofy. I mean, how I make jokes out of everything, huh? Yeah. The hairs on his jacket, scratches on his body. Buck freaking out. Stop it. Even the animal tranquilizer makes sense. I didn't tell you because, well, people don't always understand. Uncomfortable. Drowning. My hair is kind of nice. But what about being hung upside down and very slowly skimming alive? Starting with your toes. And you're under a slow trickle of lemon juice the whole time. Sure. <laughs> but you know, it's not the actual physical injury that's the worst part. It's the anticipation of the next round of torture. And there's a lot of pressure because if you say the wrong thing, it, it might make the situation more volatile. I was worried about him getting shot several times when I when I keep the mic to talk to him. drinks and then that's all I remember. The last one, right? <laughs> God, you guys, I am so fucking ass tired. Excuse my language, but man, am I freaking tired. The plan is after this episode of My Crazy X is over, I'm gonna go take my shower, wash up, and go straight to bed. The hell? Must have touched my, um, fingers when I was eating my fish or something. I, <laughs> oops, that right there, I gotta clean it off. So, I'm gonna do that now, and, uh, yeah. So, I'm just filling you in. I don't see, uh, you know, sunset. But yeah, good night, mom. No scaring me. Um, Eeyore or Piglet, hug and kiss my baby kitty. No. Oh. Hip and Dee after this. I am definitely gonna go to bed. I'll set my schedule back, guys, so. Again, if there's a glitch on it, good night now, okay? It's not funny on how exhausted I am. I feel so exhausted. It feels like 1 a.m. in the morning to me right now. Not to worry, I'm not going to show you my boobs. So... Okay, I'm going to apply shampoo on my head now, so. Oh, dang it. You can't see me, can you? Alright, well, maybe I got it too foggy in here, so. I'm going to shut off.
also got to play Bingo Blitz, too. But they were soon back on the streets. Police claim up to their own tricks. Only this time the stakes had gone much higher. Christine was eight and a half months pregnant with Kevin's baby. Even my feet feel tired, guys. I'm definitely gonna sleep all night long. Probably no stories, alright? I'm just so, so exhausted. But I will play bingo in order to get my daily credits in. Any other games will have to, you know, stop for the night. Because I've never been feeling so tired in all my freaking ass life. I'm just. I'm so exhausted. 69. Oh, 66. Round over. Alright, alright. Maybe I will try one level of something and I will show it to you, even if I don't beat it. But I won't um, play those um, ads because they get annoying and I don't want to sit through them, so. <laughs> Two different aisles out of view. A boy my age walked by and asked, Why are you laying on the floor? I responded a tad aggressively with, Because I want to. He laughed and put his hands up, the unspoken sign for whoa, take it easy. I apologized for my gruffness and told him that a man was making me nervous. He jokingly said that he'd protect me, and because he seemed harmless and I mentioned my boyfriend, I conversed with him for a while. He told me how he saw me and wondered why the blonde girl looked so sad. A little while later, I was thankful I didn't brush the stranger off because I saw the man again walking around. We made Police, the most curious evidence against Mike Morris is a phone call he made to Mary's cell phone two hours after detectives believe 
that she was murdered. This phone call lasted for four minutes. This was, by all indications of the cellular telephone company, a completed call. What you have to wonder is, what did that phone call either set in motion or uh, end? Normally, um, the, the cellular service would have kicked in and, and said that the, uh, that the party you were calling was unavailable. Uh, I didn't get that. I don't know. Mm. Mm.